Hello guys, so today I'm going to be doing an um, upgrade. So, last year I built a hacking Tosh and I've used the GeForce GTX 650 as the graphics card. Now, since then I've decided to upgrade the graphics card to EVGA GeForce GTX 960. Let's begin. So this is the computer we're going to be upgrading today. So I'm just going to take the case apart. Or to be more specific, open the left side panel. And I can't just put this away, but I can put it to the side since there's a cable connected and I'm not wanting to detach it for now so this is the old graphics card we're going to be removing it first we're going to remove the two thumb screws oh I should also disconnect this this is the 6 pin PCI power connector there we go so we can just take this thumb screw now for the other thumb screw there perfect now we can simply open this up open the slot and we release the graphics card. Get this cable out of the way. There we go. Now the graphics card is out. Now I'm gonna get from the box. This safety thing. It will protect the pins while it's disconnected. There. And I'm gonna be doing I'm gonna be using this card for another build and I'll come out with a video of that soon. Okay, now we can install the new graphics card, the GTX 960. So, let's unbox this. We have uh, Molex 26 pin, you won't need that. And then, I'm gonna pull whatever is in here. Out. Okay, I guess I opened it the wrong way. Oops, my bad. Well, let's open it from here then. Okay, yeah, that that makes more sense. Now we can take whatever this is out. Yeah, it's the graphics card itself. Okay. Now we have. This probably a poster. I won't really use it. We'll put Molex to PCI cable back in. It should never be used, in my opinion. If your power supply does not have PCI, then it's probably time for an upgrade. Anyway. Close the box. We have the graphics card itself, so we can open this up. And pull it out of the packaging. There we go. Now this is anti-static, so I can open that.
Okay, I'll have to rip this. Here. Or not. Just need to pull this. There we go. I can pull that. Get a sticker out of the way. Okay, good. So now we can take the power strip, I mean, wrap part out. Nice and new. Okay. We can take a look at it. It has one six pin PCI connector. I'm gonna remove this since I don't want it to melt on the graphics card during operation and as it says here remove protective film before use I agree totally so I'm just gonna remove it delicately so everything comes off there we go That shiny EVGA logo draws your attention. And we'll put this plastic aside. Now for the fan itself. Remove this. There we go. Okay. I'm gonna be using HDMI off of this, so unplug this HDMI protective cap. So, I'm going to remove this as well. Okay, we have the graphics card. So now, we can put it into the machine. Let me just turn the camera. Okay. So, let's put it in the machine. Now, can I go here? Slot one. PCI Express. It goes into slot. Into the slot it goes. There we go. Installed. Almost. We gotta plug this in. But there's a zip tie in the way, so I'll get rid of that later. First, though, we need to screw this in, so I'm going to get the PCI thumb screws and put them and screw them in, just like that. Okay, I think this will need a screwdriver. I'm going to get my screwdriver. Push it up, graphic card, and screw that sucker in. And then now for the second screw. Put it in the wrong way. Let me take that out. And I shall try again.
Here, now it's going in the other way. Let me just check here. Okay. That's inserted. Okay, so now I'm gonna connect this and we're all set.